welcome to my channel. It's Flo Everett again for you. Flo Everett TV welcomes you all. Uh, in today's episode, I'm going to be showing the difference between she's or she's. She's or she's. Is it she is or what? She's or she's. They choose the same, but they don't use them in the same context. We use them differently. So I'm going to show you the difference. When you hear someone saying, she's back from school, or she's been so good all this while. And the she's there are not the same. The she's used inside are not the same. So in this video, I'm going to show you the difference between she's or she's. It's a same pronunciation. But which, what makes the difference? Which one is which? Okay guys, if today is your first time of tuning into my channel, you're highly welcome. I want to say yay to 1,000 subscribers. Thank you all so much for being there, for being there, watching my videos and giving me all the support. I truly, truly appreciate this. So, in the subsequent videos, I'm going to show you examples of all the use of she's and she's. Well, I'll just take it here. Uh, she's with this means she is. And she's with this means she has. Both of them are contracted verbs that are been used. She is and she has. Has is a verb to have and is is a verb to be, which are is, are, am. Yes, so those are the contracted form, but the both of them sound the same. They all sound the same. She's, she's been too good all this while. She's been too good all this while. It's, the she's there is has, meaning she has been too good all this while. Or she is late for work. She is late for work, meaning she is late for work. But both of them are using the same pronunciation called she's she's so i'm going to show you more examples so each time when you're making sentences or when someone has spoken or said something like you do not get that person confused ah why is this person saying she's she's been so good all this while is it she is she is being so good all this while no <laughs> It's not she has been so good all this while. No, it means she has been so good all this while. She's she is going to school now. Okay, so in the other videos, uh, the subsequent uh, uh, videos, you're going to see the differences. I'm going to show you diverse or many different kinds of examples when we are using she's or she's. She's or she's okay. Stay tuned as you keep watching for Everett TV. Please, if this is your first time of tuning into this channel, please do not forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and please, when you're subscribing, also turn on the notification bell. If you don't turn it on, you won't see any new video coming out, you will not see the notification that I've uploaded new video. Okay, so please always turn on the notification bell so that you always get me updated. So guys, I like I said, I'm going to be showing you some examples of the differences between the use of these two, his or his, the use of them, she's or she's. One is for she is and one is for she has or if you're using he, his or his. One is for he is and one is for he has. So we don't get confused between them. For example, there are, someone can say, let me get some of the examples like that. He's got a big dog. He's got a big dog. So when you talk of he's got a big dog, is it the use of he is or he has? Get the answer. One, can I get the answer? He's got a big dog. What's the answer, please? Yes, it is the use of has. He has got a big dog. But now it sounds like he is a big dog. He is got a big dog. It doesn't, it doesn't go. It doesn't go. So here is the use of has, the contracted form of has. 
he's got a big dog simply means he has got a big dog but it is written like this okay so another example we can have is he's got lots of homework to do he's got lots of homework to do so he's got lots of homework to do is it he is got lots of homework to do or he has got lots of homework to do yeah it is the use of has in the contracted form he has got lots of homework to do okay another example is he's got lots of friends he's got lots of friends but when someone hears it for the first time you might think that someone who doesn't know the difference is clearly you might think that you're talking about he is got a lot of friends why are you saying english like this he is got lots of friends no it's the use of has in the contracted form so both of them are twins they, are, they resemble his or his means for for is and for has okay so he's got lots of friends simply means he has got lots of friends another example is he's never been to india or he's never been to china okay he's never been to china meaning he has never been to china another example is he's to wash the car he's to wash the car he's to wash the car simply he has to wash the car so here are the examples using his for the contracted form of has what to have is i have you have he has she has it has we have they have now i'm going to give you examples for the order which is is the verb to be is his or she's which is she is or he is okay or it's which is it's so examples could be she's an intelligent girl she's an intelligent girl meaning she is an intelligent girl she's an intelligent girl so when you look at this example she is an intelligent girl and another example for the use of is which is she is a contracted form is she's so tall she's so tall she's so tall meaning she is so tall she is so tall now if you look at she is so tall and you take that of he's so he's never been to china he's or she's never been to china she's never been to china she's so tall she's never been to china there are two things she's never been to china is she has never been to china she's so tall.